All right, what's going on, boys and girls? So, first off, apologies for the lack of good video quality, and let's not talk about the audio right now. Short version. I wanted to do a video about why, what, is, what it's like to actually be a Linux user. Like, you, you hear, oh, you have to be in the CLI all day. No. And this is me using an Arch system, because I'm on sailing an OS. I'm in the... CLI, bash, whatever you want to call it, you know, the, the blinking cursor of doom that everyone worries about. I spend maybe five minutes a month in that. I literally use the GUI for everything. Yes, it, it is no different in ease of use than the beloved macOS that everybody raves about being easy to use, etc. Really, for me, though, like day in and day out, it's no different than being any other OS user. Like, like you're going to have limited stuff. Like on these, you can do. You have limited things you can do on Windows. You have limited things you can do on macOS. Limited things you can do on Linux. So, I don't see... Well, most people don't game on Macs, let's be honest. But, uh, unless you spend $60,000... But really, at the end of the day, I don't hear complaining, bitching, or whining about what you can or cannot do. Well, this application is not available. No, because the Mac users just want the particular hardware software combination to work. And really, at the end of the day, that's kind of the approach I take with Linux. It, it It's... A general purpose OS, but at the same and yes, I know it's, it's, it's Linux is a kernel. Shut up, you fanboys. Um, really, what it boils down to for me, though, I can make it what I want, and that is far more important than anything else. So, I can tailor hardware specifically to it, or I can tailor software specifically to the hardware. That's the key thing. So all the software and hardware stuff that I do and use, I have specifically looked for to make sure it's plug and play, that it's you know it's is universally good on Linux as it is on Windows or Mac OS. And that's no different than if you were coming to from Windows to this beloved little half bitten fruit of a company. You have to make sure stuff is gonna work. It requires some research. It's not always plug and play as much as everybody wants to talk about how Mac OS is. It's not. Being a Linux user is no different than any other OS. It doesn't matter if it's Mac, Windows, Linux, Android, iOS, Blackberry 10 when it was still around. Take your pick. You are still going to have the same features and functions for the most part across your platform. It's just different applications, different ways of doing things, etc. I get really tired of hearing people coming from Windows expecting Linux to work the same way as Windows, yet when they code this damn thing, they expect it to be different. Well, no shit, Sherlock. Because when I go from this thing to what I'm using right now, which is Salient OS, I expect it to be different. So, it's not about think differently, as the fruit company likes to say. It's about <laughs> understand differently. Understand that things are different on different platforms. And it's not about you know, Linux users just being a hipster and different. It's about they, are, they have certain functions and needs that work best for them. This is all the people who go to this stupid platform think it's the best features and functions for them, or Windows is for them, FreeBSD is for them. Don't judge them and people who use it based off your own fucking preconceived notions and ignorance. Here's a brilliant, brilliant idea. Try actually using it.